Hey guys, welcome back. Today I just wanted to do a real quick video for you about something new that I found on the Sephora website, which has not always been out. And first, disclaimer, I apologize. Um, it, I am outside, it's really dark, but it's brighter outside than it is inside, and I'm at my parents, so... I don't have my lights, I didn't bring anything with me, I just brought my camera, um, so insert that here. But anyway, um, so I was on the Sephora website looking around and I saw something new that I just wanted to share with you guys and that is that Burberry, ooh, Burberry is now available on the Sephora website. Um, and look at this box. Cute. It's, it's a very sturdy solid box and it's got the Burberry logo and everything on it um but this kit I think was like 30 something dollars um, I just wanted to dabble into Burberry I have tried Burberry things before fragrance wise I've never gone to a Burberry counter or anything and I see every um, UK beauty vlogger, blogger, YouTuber talk about Burberry and it's not something that it's the easiest to get your hands on in the States. It is but it isn't. It depends on if you've got a counter near you and if you're like me and you're in more of a rural area, um, that's not that's not really happening. Um, so I was excited to see this and I got this because it's got a little bit of everything in it. It has, um, let me see, it's got like a base piece, um, a cheek and eye piece, a lip piece, and a brush. So it really lets you encompass fully everything that Burberry has to offer. And I thought it was a great way to start. And there's a Burberry foundation called, um, I think I just saw it's like cashmere or something. And I can't wait to get my hands on it. I didn't see it on the Sephora website. So it, so far, I've just only seen that you can get it at Burberry counters. Um, but, come on Sephora, come on, like, I want to come in and get color matched. I just don't trust, you know, doing things online, but I'm going to, and jump right in. The first thing in there is this little guy, and this is the Burberry Fresh Glow Lumi Luminous Fluid Base in Nude Radiance or number one, and it's just five mils. Um, I'm actually wearing this today, but look at this. I don't even want to waste it by putting it on the back of my hand. But look at how pretty that is. It blends in so well. And then it just leaves this really light, dewy sheen. So, I mean, I don't even think you can see it, but it just leaves a sheen on your skin. Not greasy, not super glittery and chunky. I have that on, um, you can't really tell, but it just kind of gives more of a lit from within type of a glow, which I'm all about versus like looking like a grease monkey, so. Next thing they've got in here, which this is just beautiful, I mean, Let's just take a moment and admire the packaging. Like, look at that. It's just beautiful. The, you know, Burberry Tartan logo. Um, it's textured, you can feel it. And this is Earthy Blush, number seven, a light glow. And it is a contouring face and eye powder. Now, open it and you've got this beautiful, beautiful shade of brown. It has a little eye applicator so you can use it whoop, as a shadow. I wanna keep that little mirror protector on there. This is heavy. Like this little compact has some serious weight to it. It is heavy and it smells so good. But the first thing you notice when you rub Burberry powder products is just, I mean, they're like silken butter silken butter so creamy so smooth so buttery they're just mm. there's an estate sale going on across the street so that's what all that background noise is but I'm gonna swatch it it's so close to my skin color I love this to put like just 
on my eyes as kind of a base and transition. This is not gonna be a contouring color for me. For someone more fair, it may be. It's a little on the warm side to contour. I think this is warm to contour with. Um, but someone that's way more fair, I could see that being a contour shade. But I just can't get over how buttery, and this feels like a cream product, but it is not. It is amazing, and if you get this, you totally realize the difference between drugstore or lower end and then a higher end product like Burberry. I mean, it's amazing. And then to go with that, in this little guy, it's wrapped up, is actually a little face brush, and it's just square. I'm not gonna take the plastic off. And then it's great for just getting that color right into the hollows of your cheeks. Like, this is an amazing size to contour and you can dip that into the powder and then just really carve out and give yourself some shadow. I did try it and that, I mean that shade's not 100% not for me. It does give a little bit of um, a grayish hollow for a grayish tone in the hollow of my cheeks, which I liked and I thought it was really pretty. I just primarily use it as a shadow kind of, it's a really great shadow if you're doing that no makeup makeup look that you know, it's out there. And then lastly in this little kit, we have this little cute, teeny, tiny, wonderful for travel lipstick. And it is Military Red number 109. And it's a gram, so, you know. But look at that. I mean, that is, um, that is a red red. It's more orange based, I think, than anything. But it's not super orange, it's not super blue. And let me just. Look at how pretty. That is such a beautiful red. Now that I'm looking at it on my skin, it's way more orange based than blue based, but look at how pretty that is. Just a beautiful, real red color. It's a lighter red. Um, I think this set was probably meant for more fair skin tones, but I mean, come on. It's got that, it doesn't really have a scent. Like the shadow has that Burberry scent but, which I like, I think it just smells delicious. But this does, lipstick doesn't have a scent. It feels really nice on the lips. I'm not wearing it today, um, as you can tell. Big difference. Um, it's creamy, it's not matte, it's a satin finish, but it's just so beautiful. Like, it has a sheen to it, but it's just so pretty. It sits well on the lips. I have put it on my lips. It sits well, it sits nice. You don't really have to worry about too much. It, I mean, it is not gonna stay put. It doesn't claim to stay put or anything like that. But I just thought it was so pretty. So I wanted to share that with you guys and just show you that you can get your hands on some Burberry things. Oh, and I forgot this. This cute little piece of like race paper or onion paper, whatever you wanna call it, which just um, says Discover Burberry Runway Icons. And that's what the box is. And it tells you what the base is for, the powder and face, and then the um, Burberry Kisses Hydrating Lip Color. Um, and it says that it gives six hours of continuous hydration. So that's really awesome. And then the rest of it's just pretty self-explanatory. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, if you wanna follow me on Instagram and Twitter, the links are below in the description bar. Like I've said before, the messaging system on YouTube is odd I'm not getting notified too much so if you want to talk to me I want to talk to you I am over on Twitter pretty much all the time even if I'm not posting I'm looking and to see if anybody's talking to me um, so yeah you can follow me on Instagram for my little day-to-day -day pictures of food and people and I will see you guys next time bye this size bottle is I think like 120 130 but you can get like a one ounce or something that might be like around 70, 80, 90 